This is a uh, Proline Flame Guard American water heater. It has a gas valve made by Honeywell. Uh, this is a uh, the newer style. It has uh, a thermocouple connection that goes in right there and um, has the gas valve inlet. The pilot adjustment knob for setting up heat. This, there's a uh, uh, status light right here. Now my status light is out, uh, which means my pilot's out. So first thing I'm going to try is get the uh, pilot light going and uh, let's see what happens. First you uh, set the uh, position of the knob to pilot and go and press and hold it in and there is a igniter button right here. I'm going to try and push the igniter button several times for 60 seconds. Uh, to see uh, if my uh, pilot line co comes on. Okay, um, I see my pilot light is on. Uh, if you want to take a closer look, here we go. I want to see if I can now start my gas heater by turning the knob towards heat or hot. I heard a click but what I also should have heard is a sound of ignition. Uh, what I've noticed uh, on mine, um, the pilot light slowly dies out and um, it's actually dying right now. Uh, it actually just stopped blinking. That just confirms that uh, I have a bad uh, something. Now we're gonna troubleshoot it. First thing, uh, we're gonna check the thermocouple. Now thermocouple is located on the heater, but the connection to it is right there. Now if the thermocouple is working good, I'm going to try to start up, uh, get the pilot light going, I should have some uh, voltage coming out of thermocouple because that's what uh, powers this uh, controller or the uh, valve uh, control assembly. Let's try that. These are snap-ins, they just come out like that. And then I'm going to take my multimeter and I'm going to set it to millivolts or something that can read millivolt. I'm going to put the uh, and this goes in here. Right now it reads a really low voltage. Uh, I should see 350 or about. It can go up to 600, 700 millivolts. I'm going to put it back to the pilot position here and uh, hold it and then go from 1 to You can see my um, multimeter. Okay, my thermocouple is good because I get a good voltage here. I'm gonna wait in uh, for a few minutes, a few seconds here to let the gas uh, vent out. I know I can see a uh, flame when I try to uh, get the pilot on. The pilot comes on. I can see it on for a few seconds maybe a minute and then now uh, you know it slowly dies out I try to uh, increase the, the the heat and I can hear a click but nothing comes on so that sounds like a gas valve problem so we're gonna see if that is a gas valve problem let me call my manufacturer and try to get a uh, replacement because this tank is under warranty it usually is to about five to six years warranty so you should be able to get a part uh, from the manufacturer. Yeah, I was uh, able to call my manufacturer. They sent me a, uh, a gas valve. This is a brand new. You can see the uh, gas inlet and the different connections here. This is for the igniter. These are the two leads for the thermocouple. There's some more connections here for the pilot. We're gonna try and put this one in place of that. Uh, we'll find out uh, what challenges we'll face, but it should be a fairly simple swap.